Okay. Um, we were presented with a uh, hummingbird uh, just the other day, and it turns out that the hummingbird, according to the radiographs, actually had a radial fracture, non-displaced, uh, and that's still very difficult to see on the x-rays. Anyway, that will be my assessment at this point in time. Anyway, our buddy here has actually taken well to syringe feeding, and then from there we've actually set him up with some bottles of two flavors of hummingbird food, and this guy's done really well. What makes difficult for hummingbirds is one, they don't uh, habituate well to change, and uh, two, they, they're just such high metabolisms, they have to eat so often that it's difficult for us taking care of other patients and so forth to be able to monitor them and keep them up to par. The good news is this guy really wanted to play well in the sandbox, and as you can see, this guy is doing well. Um, here, the radiographs popping up now. Anyway, the uh, odds of getting a hummingbird out of a veterinary hospital is usually very, very low. Um, I have an unknown number back there in a jar that I have been saving over the years that one day I was going to make uh, some kind of a display case or turn over to the Nature Museum. But uh, they've not asked for them, and I've not had a chance to work on them, so right now it's just being preserved for posterity. Uh, sadly, the number is more than 20, and in the past several years, you've only gotten about three or four back into, uh, into the wild. Anyway, so this is kind of one of those really cool cases. I spend a lot of time watching this guy, and everyone that comes back in the treatment room just loves to watch him you know, bounce around the cage and so forth. He's gone from barely hovering and holding his wing out to actually hovering for five and ten minutes at a time and doing these neat little somersaults and stuff inside of his Wingabago. Speaking of which, I want to thank the uh, makers of the Wingabago for actually giving me my free cage and, uh, and doing some wonders for that there. Anyway, so uh, that's where we are for now. Uh, seems to be a real cool case. All right, later. Very good, little bunny.
Hummingbird says, day three of captivity, came in with right injured wing. Creatures caught me, brought me in here, kept me captive, fed me medicine. Stuck me inside glass house, cruel, how cruel. <laughs> Is this time where the Father Guido starts to do the invitation? I don't think so. Alright, uh, day three, this guy came in. He actually could not move his wing much. Uh, he even got some x-rays. The good news is this guy is actually hovering. I just watched him hover for a complete 30, 40 seconds. And uh, so far, so good. Alright. Oh, yeah. Show him what you got. Bzz. Do. All right, one of the coolest parts about doing micro creatures and exotics is how you have to do a lot of stuff on your microscope. This is a hummingbird fecal sample. How's that for pretty? Mm. <laughs> Day four of captivity. They've locked me in this glass wing of bago and they won't let me out. I hate it here. I just hate it. I want to go back to fighting, beating up my friends, fighting over the plastic flower with the sugar water in it. I want to go back. <laughs> the hell is in the background? When did we start giving old Roy treats? What the hell is that? Is that for a border? Mm -hmm. All right, well, it's gotta be for a border. We don't carry that stuff. All right, sorry, got sidetracked. <laughs> but the good news is, you got free food, two different flavors. Obviously, he likes the plain. No, you cannot have it as a pet. Nice try there. Yeah, I got the video going. <laughs> <laughs> because it's against federal law. <laughs> Don't dress this fast. <laughs> that's, that's me. It's a wonder I can cock and flatchel at the same time. <laughs> 
The things I put up with around here. You think I won't do it? I ain't scared. All right, sustained flight a whole lot better. He's actually holding his wing almost perfectly even with the other one. He may set him free tomorrow. All right, that's good news for now.